Hello and hi, good morning. Uh, good morning. I just woke up actually, and now I need to do my movie review about. Um, basically, I'm going to do movie review about Five and Me. Ah, don't get me wrong, don't get me wrong. I'm not going to do a movie review talking about Titanic in 1997. No, I'm going to talk about Titanic. The new Titanic that has been remade for this. Um, that has been remade uh, Titanic in the year, two, in the year 2012. Um, the new version of Titanic. Titanic in 3D. Yeah, you guys hear me right. Titanic in 3D. It's something different, right? So, I have watched it, Titanic, yesterday. And I have made my movie, and I have made my review about it. So, now, basically, I'm gonna share my review uh, with you guys. I guess you guys to hear it. Okay, I'm sure you guys ready to get to hear it. So guys, basically, um, let me tell you, okay? Um, basically, Titanic is a movie based on a large ship that is predict, that predict, unthinkable. Uh, Titanic? But Titanic has met has met with disaster when it strikes an iceberg. Titanic was directed by James Cameron and starred by Leonardo Leonardo DiCaprio as Jack and. He was really handsome that time. He is uh, a dark hair, light hair, and he wrinkled as well. I'm telling you, they really make such a good pair. I just love both of them. They just look, they just look good together. Okay, okay, let's go. Um, for the mark. Okay, okay. It is this movie. It is about a real story that has happened hundred years ago. That's right. That's true. This story is a based on the story that has happened hundred years ago, and we are still talking about it till now, after hundred years. This is the true love story. True story. Of Jake and Rose who have fallen in love despite of having different family backgrounds, meet during the ill fated maiden voyage of the largest ship Titanic. Okay. You guys know that, um, you guys, as you guys know, right, that Cameron has used the 3D for this film with a dynamic offering joints of Cameron Avatar and Martin Scar City. Uh, Martin Scar City. Really have produced a more a much more good quality of movie of picture, and we will be made the days for the super 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 quality of 3D over 2D viewing. The brightness of the movie was affected because of the usage of. Uh, have what is the film look slightly, slightly dim, and uh, is it worth to watch 
a movie that are using 3D, but the quality of the picture are not satisfactory. Yeah, it's true. Why should we watch a movie that the that the quality of the movie is that the quality of the movie have slightly dim the brightness of the movie is slightly dim. And as you guys know, Sesame is a long movie. Um, it's a long uh, movie. It took about three plus three hours plus film. It is a three hours plus film. But don't. But still, after I have watched it, right, I didn't feel it it enough. Because of the good combination of a good directing skill by camera and talented writing that has created a great film plot that was written clearly. I feel it has given me a deep, clear image to the audience, not just to me, to the audience, to the other people as well of what had happened before and felt as if we were part of it. Cycling sing song. Um my heart will go on sang by Celine Dion. I'm sure a lot of people have heard that song. It's a very famous song. I have heard that song ever since I was here so I was in a little so uh, a little ago, um, I think that I was like nine or ten years old. Still not sure. No, but I have heard the song and I still remember the song till now. It gave me a really big impact. Yeah. So, um, that song really has touched the heart of a million people, of million people. It was sang beautifully by Celine Dion and it gave a beautiful touch. To the film, to the movie. Without Titanic theme song, I wouldn't imagine it wouldn't it wouldn't be found as Titanic. But the song is a part of Titanic, and without it, it would be it it would be surely sound different. Um, then okay, guys, that song. Okay, guys, then. A plot. I mean, sorry. That's a um a scene. Um, it's quite fantastic scene. Uh, where a ringlet poster in nude in the scene. Where the casual paints a ringlet in nude pose. This scene should be as tight as excited um, by the censor as it is negative and inappropriate to view to the audience. So I think we should censor it. We should cut it off to the scene. I'm sure a lot of we should cut off this scene. I'm sure a lot of people is a B with me. So, so a while the movie is really, really good to watch. I think everyone should watch it to try a different, to see the different aspects, to feel, to feel, to feel a different, to feel a different thing. It's a very different feeling to watch Titanic. There is something about Titanic that is hard to explain. Really, it's a really a unique, a really a special movie for me. Not to me, just but personally for me, it's a really special movie. And it's a based in, it's a movie based on a true love story that is hard to find a way. It's really hard to find a true love story nowadays. I'm sure you guys understand. I'm trying to say. 
onion. You guys, it's pretty scandal, you guys have to watch it to see and to understand what actually I'm talking about this, what actually I mean by this different feeling about this movie. So basically just that um just um um basically I have finished uh my movie review my video about film fighting. Um I'll be doing video soon um uh, talking about my other movie reviews. So I hope that you guys will enjoy reading my reviews and I hope that you guys will enjoy reading um my blog, reading mine and my mine and my friend blog, Sharon and Will. So I hope that you guys will continue viewing our blog and will comment on it if you guys have any negative or any positive or any opinion about anything. Please comment on it and please give us so that we can see it, we can improve ourselves after reading it because we really need a feedback from you guys. So that's all. Um, that's all. Hope you guys will have a blast, blast, a good time. Hope you guys have a nice day. Take care. Okay. Bye. And good morning again. <laughs>